Tonight, a brand new season of Forensic Files 2 premieres right here on HLN with back-to-back -back episodes to kick off the crime-solving fan favorite series. Joining me to talk about season three, Nancy Duffy, Senior Vice President of Program Development for CNN and HLN. Nancy, great to see you. This is exciting, Forensic Files 2, season three, and this is a fan favorite. Well, thank you for having me. We are so excited for this new season. We have great stories this year. Why do you think that the fans get so attached to this? Is that they feel maybe involved in a way that they could say, oh yeah, that connects to that, and they feel like they could solve it at home? I think that's true. I think that not only that, I think we lay out the story in real time. So the investigators are bringing the viewers along and they are dogged in their pursuit of these criminals who are, these stories we do, the criminals are quite clever. They really feel they've gotten away with it. And sometimes they've gotten away with these crimes for over 40 years. But eventually, dogged pursuit and the science solves the case. What goes into the decision making on which stories get covered on the show? First of all, the science is the key. We are looking for stories that were solved by incredible science, forensics. Also, participation by law enforcement, because unlike a lot of the shows that we do in true crime, the focus is not as much on the victim as it is on the investigators and the scientists. It actually, many people don't know this, but Forensic Files was the inspiration for CSI. And as you know, that storyline is about the scientists, the forensics, and the investigators, less so than the victims. And it really just hooks the viewers in to try to see how they're solving it, as you mentioned. I wanna show a clip now from one of the other episodes on season three. She's respected, she's successful, and she's fighting for her life. It was really something terrible. She was deathly ill. No cause was found for the illness. It was so sad to see her like that. Is this a job for doctors or detectives? They were very frustrated, very angry. After multiple tests, they finally found something that was really mysterious. And that something is a different kind of smoking gun. A single pack of cigarette, that's all that he needed. Nancy Duffy, exciting stuff. Thanks so much. Good to talk to you. Thank you, Susan. And don't miss it. The brand new season of Forensic Files 2 starts tonight. Back-to-back -back episodes, 10 p.m. Eastern, right here on HLN. Here's a sneak peek of what's to come. The quiet of a country farm is shattered by a fatal explosion. It blew Roberto in pieces. He caught on fire. There are thousands of bits of evidence and almost as many questions. They went out to a crime scene and they collected things that, quite frankly, didn't belong there at the scene. And one more thing is out of place. It's found on a sheet of paper that's blank but still loaded with information. When you see it, it's like, oh my gosh, that is, that's what that is. That's what's happening. New episodes of Forensic Files 2 are coming to HLN. People were shocked. It's the weirdest thing that I've ever experienced. More new cases. This is a type of situation that could simply go unsolved. More new evidence. It just looks suspicious. Are you saying I do? More justice. This case would have been exponentially more difficult if we did not have the forensics. Forensic Files 2 returns with more mysteries tonight at 10 on HLN.